my first basketball memory was probably shooting the three over my brother. That's what I remember. I was a kid and I was like, oh, he's tall. I'm going to shoot over him. I made it and I was happy. I remember that. The moment I started basketball, that my mom bought me uh, a basketball jersey right before I started. Uh, it was like, because my birthday is around Christmas. So my mom gave it to me on Christmas and I was like really stoked to start basketball. And that's, yeah, that's my first basketball memory. Like first not bucket. Do you know your first bucket? Yeah. Tell me. My first bucket, I was I was dribbling the ball, and then the guy tried to come up on me, and I hit him with a little shimmy step back, and I hit the three on him, and then. How old were you? I was like six. Bro, that's so different though. Cause my, <laughs> cause my first bucket was probably just a regular layup really? in a game, yeah, something like that. <laughs> and then I, it wasn't even a good layup. It was just, ah, just throw it at the board. It yeah, it. just throw it. I was nine. First impression of Otis. Uh, I'm very happy I came here. I'm very, I'm very. Uh, very happy with the impressions uh, they gave me. It, lo it looked, the gym is nice, the gym is nice, especially when we play on the hard floor. Especially when we play on the hard floor, Dimitri, I'm looking at you. Because <laughs> uh, I've been playing a couple of games here, because the last year I came, I come from Apollo. So I know the hard, flo I'm the hard floor, and that's, that's pretty nice. Yeah, my first impression was good. Like, all the people out here and stuff are nice, and the court's nice. I like the hoops, I like the way the ball goes into the net, so I think it's pretty cool out here. Stretch, definitely stretch, definitely stretch. It helps. I'm young, but stretch. Even, listen to our mind, he's, he's about to get old. Stretch, yeah. stretch. I'm getting close, you gotta stretch. You gotta stretch. <laughs> you know yours? Yeah. I definitely know mine too. <laughs> I do. There was this one game, like it was an AU game, and I was like 14 years old, and it was in, we were playing this team, and I was in eighth grade, and I went to go try to dunk it, and I just, didn't dunk it. It looked real bad. Like I tried to dunk it and fall. Like it was terrible. <laughs> so it was a real blooper. <laughs> same, same with me. Yeah. It was like one of my first semi-pro games. Uh, it was a semi-pro game uh, at Long Smith, and uh, like I didn't play that many minutes, and I just I couldn't really shoot either. The only thing I could do was jump and dunk. But so I got a wide open fast break. Help get a steal. Wide open fast break. I'm just going. I jumped up. And my 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 foot that I jump off slipped, so I just fell backwards, threw the ball up somewhere, and I just laid on the ground. It was horrible. What was that word? Don Quixote. Don Quixote. Yeah, yeah Don Quixote. That was the first mm -hmm. word I learned. I just barely learned it, but I like it. It's nice. Oh, the one I remember the most was on a three x three tournament, because uh, it was a posterized dunk. It was my first posterized dunk too, so that's the one I like most. That's my favorite one. Yeah. That's yeah, I remember one I had, it was my freshman year of high school. I, I was 15, we were playing Mount Tahoma High School. And like, there was like 10 seconds left and I stole the ball and I went and dunked it. It was like my first in-game dunk. Like, and I just loved it. Like, everybody went crazy because nobody was expecting it. Like, and there was a guy in the picture and like, he was like this, like looking all scared. Like, and I just dunked it all over him. It was lovely. <laughs> <laughs> Um, there was some Dutch candy I tried. It was like some sweet candy, like sweet sour candy that like we don't have in America. Like I like candy and it Sudamata. was really good. Luka Luka Sudamata, the Regenboog Sudamata. Yeah. Oh. It was too good, like so good. <laughs> Disgusting. <laughs> uh, we hope to see you there soon. We hope to see you here in Kalverdijk. Uh, and we hope you'll be great fans. We already love you. We don't know. We haven't seen you yet, but have you any words for them yet? Yes, yeah, just be patient with us. We're a new team, but we're going to play hard for you guys so you guys show up and we're not going to disappoint. Definitely not.